Bayraktar TB3 UCAV sets new altitude record with domestically produced engine. Baycar persists in its rigorous testing of the Bayraktar TB3 unmanned combat aerial vehicle UCAB, a product of indigenous development and original design. Demonstrating remarkable success, the company's latest UCAV, which took its inaugural flight on October 27, 2023, in commemoration of the Republic's centennial, continues to excel in medium and high-altitude performance evaluations. It recently completed another test, breaking a new record in the process. In a recent flight conducted at the Akinsey Flight Training and Test Center in Korlu, Tekerdag, the Bayraktar TB3 UCAV successfully completed the High Altitude System Performance Test, reaching an altitude of 33,000 feet. Powered by the PD-170, an indigenous engine developed by TI, the UCAV achieved a significant milestone by ascending to the highest altitude ever attained by an aircraft with an indigenous engine during the test. The Bayraktar TB3 achieved a significant milestone in Turkish aviation history by setting a new altitude record. Developed indigenously by Baykar, the Bayraktar Akinsey UCAV now holds the Turkish aviation altitude record at 45,118 feet. Throughout its test flights, the Bayraktar TB3 UCAV has logged an impressive total airborne time of 327 hours and 35 minutes. Notably, during a lengthy test flight on December 20, 2023, the indigenous aircraft remained airborne for 32 hours covering a distance of 5,700 kilometers in the skies. On March 26, 2024, the Bayraktar TB3 UCAV made its inaugural flight equipped with a Selsun's indigenous Acelflur 500 camera pod. This test marked the successful integration of Baycar's Bayraktar TB3 UCAV with the Acelflur 500 electro-optical reconnaissance surveillance, and targeting system. Notably, the Acelflur 500 system demonstrates superior performance compared to similar products worldwide. With its foldable wings, the Bayraktar TB3 UCAV is poised to become the world's inaugural armed drone capable of both taking off and landing on short runway vessels like TCG Anadolu. Selchuk Bayraktar, chairman and CTO of Baycar, had earlier revealed the company's intention to commence testing the Bayraktar TB3 on TCG Anadolu by the end of 2024. This milestone will mark a significant advancement in unmanned aerial vehicle capabilities within its class. Equipped with beyond line of sight, BLOS, communication capabilities, the indigenous drone will be operable from extensive distances. This feature will empower the Bayraktar TB3 to execute reconnaissance, surveillance, intelligence, and offensive missions, utilizing its smart munitions against targets abroad, significantly bolstering Turkey's deterrent capabilities. Internally, and has garnered 83% of its total revenue from exports since initiating UAV R&D in 2003. As per data from the Turkish Exporters Assembly TM, for 2021 and 2022, Baykar emerged as the leading exporter in the defense and aviation sector. Recognized as the export champion of the sector by the Presidency of Defense Industries in 2023, Baycar achieved exports totaling $1.8 billion in the previous year. In recent years, Baycar has derived over 90% of its revenue from exports, contributing significantly to the defense and aviation sector by representing one-third of its total exports in 2023 alone. As the leading exporter of UAVs globally, Baycar currently has 97.5% of its contracted projects originating from international markets. 
Export agreements for the Bayer Actor TB2 UAV have been established with 33 countries, while negotiations for the Bayer Actor Akinsey UCAV have already secured agreements with nine nations.